Yeah, hey everybody, it's Brian with you from the GameCom, and we're back playing some more Mutant Year Zero, continuing on with the House of Bones, basically just trying to take out all of the guys uh, on the outside, one at a time, and hopefully then from there we can uh, uh, actually do this mission. I'm a little concerned because there's still like two guys on the inside by themselves, and I'm not quite sure how we're supposed to take them both on. I mean, the thing is, I could kill one of them in, in one turn, so then it would leave us three on one, which wouldn't be that big of a deal. The issue is it then spawning a bunch of other guys that we're gonna have to go kill that's where there's gonna run into an issue so you have five points available oh yeah because we're going for corpse eater twitch shot let's see what does this one do fire two using only one ap okay so essentially you fire twice but it probably still ends your turn but you get to fire twice um but you have less accuracy which you know probably is good but i think i still would rather get corpse eater just to save some of our med kits so i don't really know how many more guys we're gonna have to kill um, definitely looks like we have some here. Now, it's been a couple days since I played, so I kind of forgot all of the hotkeys. So, that guy's a level 20. Oh, shoot, 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 shoot. Come back, come back, come back, come back, come back. Um, I'm gonna put you here. Let's get you here. Uh, oh, Lee. oh, God, oh, God, oh, God, oh, God, oh, God. Ah, ambush. Actually, we don't need to ambush because I think we're fine. Um, but we got 100% crit on you. Uh, definitely, like, let's not shoot at those guys. Uh, let's just see if we got 100% on, uh, one of you guys. Yeah, okay, so we should be good to fire this time. So, let's go ahead and do it. Let's fire a weapon. I'm a little concerned because it's just like, oh god, it's been a couple days, so I kind of, like, forgot everything, but I think we're good. So then we're gonna fire. Uh, will in turn. We did fire with this silent weapon, we did. Okay. Oh, we just critted you. Oh, nice. Take out the zone trash achievement unlocked. Nice. All right. Well, that works. That works. That works. That works. Uh, and then let's go ahead and recall you. Then we just have the single guy over here all by him lonesome. So this guy shouldn't be that big of a deal. No. No. The problem is range is a little bit of a problem. Why are you... What? What's going on here? Oh, we need to regroup. That's the issue. All right. So then let's go throw you here. And then we're going to take you up and around over here. And sure. And then hopefully 100%. Hopefully 100%. I mean, the thing is, I could actually move them closer. That's not an issue. Because as long as we kill them, right? I'm pretty sure as long as we kill them, we're fine. Yeah, I think we're fine even if they spot us. Somehow that didn't get you spotted. Confused by that, but okay. Uh, fire weapon. Crit damage. Nice. And then let's move you up here. And it doesn't say... Okay, there's the spot. But we've gotten caught sneaking before, and uh, we've still been fine. So, alright, that should be good. Okay! Okay, okay. Hold up, my wife was calling me. No, okay. Level up. Nice, 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 nice. We like to see those. Um, let's go ahead and regroup. Uh, hand grenade is nice. There was actually something with this other guy, too, by the way. I didn't pick up. So let's go get some loot. Cool. Okay. Cleaning out the trash, man. We are cleaning out the trash. I'm feeling a little more confident in this game, I think. Um, as we figured that we could take these guys. Now that I got the third silent weapon, I'm feeling a lot better about life, just in general. Because, you know, we can actually now take on most of these groups of guys. We can kill them in one turn. In fact, we can probably go back to that one zone a couple zones ago and actually take them out. Now, can we take out the med bot? So, 16 HP... Sixteen HP, so that's five, ten, fifteen. Plus, when you consider the armor, there's no way we take out the med bot. So the med bot is not going to be possible to kill, at least yet. So we're going to have to fight him in the final group. Uh, there is a sect hunter running around. That's okay. Uh, if we go up there, we can't do anything. So it looks like we're going to want to probably take out that guy. And actually, it looks like these guys split up up top. Huh, so they must have finished talking and then they split up. Yeah, they did split up, so we can take these guys out one at a time then. Okay, 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 I'm good with that. The thing is, man, I wish there was a way to tell who's left on the map. 
I mean, I suppose we could just look at the mini-map. How do we get up there, by the way? Well, I think there was a ladder on the outside or something. I'm trying to remember. I, I was up there once, was I not? Can I, can I not climb through the window? Scrap. By the way, we should be able to do this, right? Without them spotting us? Yeah, it looks like it. Still a little concerned. <laughs> yeah, I'm still like, eh, I'd rather not do that. Okay, sect hunter. Now, what happens if they run across a dead body? So, for example, Mr. Sect hunter, they see their dead body lying on the ground. Is that, uh, does that turn into a problem? I don't know. I'm going to put you here. Because I'm assuming this guy is going to end up coming back this way, I feel like. Yo, piggy boy, can you move? Thank you. I think he's got to come back this way, right? I'm just hoping the sect hunter is going to end up walking that way. Okay, we got a marauder. Uh, let's go. Recall. Recall. Okay, so we do have a marauder that's over there. We can go kill. Um, let's go kill the guys upstairs first, though. Yeah, I think let's just go kill those guys first. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. One guy at a time. It's it's a little interesting, all the sneaking around and how you have to do things here. Um, not bad. It's just definitely a little different than what I think you're expecting. Now, this shouldn't matter because... Dang it. So, I didn't think because there was a wall between us, I didn't think that was actually going to happen. All right, well, at least it auto-saved right where we ended, so that's probably for the best. Okay, recall you, let's regroup, and let's go do this again, and let's just, like, run over there. Um, okay, yeah. Actually, that might have gotten us spotted, so good thing I turned the thing off. Uh, we're going to have to walk all the way around this freaking building. Yeah... I hate it, but it almost feels like they've made this game in such a way that you kind of have to reload a little bit. Yeah, it definitely kind of feels that way. Just because, like, if you do the fights in slightly the wrong order, you're just screwed. You just die. Like, we're just going to take on 20 guys, and there's no way to exit combat and run away. So it's like, well, we're just screwed now. So, you, you know. Uh, All right, let's do this. I want to hide you here. I would like... No, 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 no. Oh, my gosh. Team... Hurry up. I got to kill this guy before that other guy gets into position. All right. Hide here. Now, we got to be careful with that of the pyro, man. Think he can be... You think he will see us? I, I actually don't know. That had to hurt. We're going to try it, and we're going to see whether or not that engages the other guy. It says he saw us, but the thing is, I don't think he does yet. I don't know if that other guy knows we're here yet. Nice crit. Nice crit. All right, piggy boy. Let's make sure we use the silence. 75% screw. Just shoot it. You should hit. All right, let's see if this worked. Sleep it off. Is the other guy dead? Or engaged? No, he's not. Okay, perfect. Perfect. Hey, so let's regroup. Actually, Split hey, just up. go on your own right now. Okay, you come over here. And then... I'm just gonna hide you here. And let's just go here, because I can move him forward and shoot, so I'll be fine. Alright, activate. Hi, hello, Mr. Pyro. Let's go ahead and shoot you 100%. Do some damage. He's pulling out some weapons. Doesn't he explode when he dies? I think everyone else will hear that. I don't know, that's a good question. Uh, let's shoot with the silence weapon. One of these days, I'm going to hit the wrong button. And accidentally shoot with our uh, non-silenced weapon. Okay, and then we're going to move you here. And that's 100%. You spot me. It doesn't matter. Hello. Murder. I still know how we didn't get spotted that last time. We did not get the kill. What? Okay. Does everyone else know we're here? Oh, all right. So we totally just killed this guy without having to worry about anyone else. 
In the scheme of things, that's fine. Duck took a little bit of pro uh, damage, but that's fine. All right, that works. Uh, okay. So, why didn't everyone else on the map get engaged that turn? Maybe because we didn't actually shoot anything but silence? Are we learning that as long as we use silenced weapons, we only fight one group at a time? That's what it almost feels like. Uh, okay, boomstick. Long, uh, firearm is worn and scratched. So, it has eight damage, which seems really good. I think that actually should replace my piggy weapon. Okay, so as long as everyone else doesn't know we're there, or as long as we use silence weapons, we don't have to worry about engaging any other wave? Is that what I'm finding out? That's the only thing I can think of. We also had some stuff over here. Weapon parts. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Um, let's go check inventory. So, piggy boy, you have the scatter gun, which is only six damage, man. And that is level two, too. Where the boomstick is just significantly better. It has 5% less crit. It has a slightly less uh, range. I think it's worth it. I don't think there's any way, shape, or form that that gun is not worth it. Um, the question is, do we want to move this around? This is just a strictly better weapon than what you have with the gaper. Okay, I'm good with that. And then... I think I keep the state switcher on you. It's only five damage as opposed to six. But I like that 20 range. I like the 20 range. I think the 20 range is worth it. Yeah, I think the 20 range is worth it. Here's the other thing. Uh, let's go grab you. Uh, and I want to put the needler there. And I want to put the boomstick there. Yeah, just so we always have the silent weapon to begin with. Okay, okay, I think we're in a good spot for fighting the boss. Let's go move down these steps. Um, let's turn you off. And do I just drop? Is that gonna is that gonna hurt me? Uh, no. <laughs> Ugh, this game's weird. Uh, Marauders incoming. Good. Let's go hide you here. Why are you guys not? <gasps> Why are you guys not on the ground? Oh my god, 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 oh my god. I have to ambush now. Because he was about to get hit. But I think we can move the other guy probably in a position to get a kill anyways. Alright, uh, crit chance. Dang it. That's fine. Alright, so I can't move him down. But we have the height range. No, I need the crossbow. 100% chance. Wait, why was why did you not have the crossbow selected? Did I put the crossbow? <gasps> okay, that was scary, by the way. That was scary. Leveled up again. Good, 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 good. Yeah, that that was a little um scary. Uh, okay, E. Uh, I again. You have the crossbow first, so I'm not quite sure what happened there. Now, with the character mutation, you should be at seven. Yeah, there you go. Boom, give me Corpse Eater. <laughs> These are really cool, dude. I like the mutations. They're pretty awesome. They're pretty awesome. Okay, 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 okay. Uh, let's regroup, guys. Let's regroup. I think all that's left is this final wave. We can look around. We got one guy there. We got another guy this way. So let's go kill this guy. I don't know who this guy is, but we will be able to uh, murder him off pretty easily. Probably. If we can find him. <coughs> Excuse me. My voice is a little rough from this weekend. But anyways. Uh, I am back in town, which is always great. There is no one over here, game. There is no one over here. So I'm not quite sure why you're telling me to go that way. Maybe he's up the stairs? Because isn't there actually... Yeah, maybe he is up this way. I don't think there's anything that way, though. I'm pretty sure that's another zone. Surely they're not telling me that there's someone else in another zone, right? Surely not. He's got to be over here. I don't know if this guy gets engaged if all of a sudden we shoot, uh, start shooting with everyone else. I still think if there's a guy over there, we should just kill him off. i still not seen anyone. We did find some rare scrap, though. Weapons are getting pretty good. We're at 25, so we're about uh, ready to upgrade our boomstick. Yeah, I'm thinking maybe it's just in the next area. Because I just don't... I wish every zone had a map. 
like an actual map that I could pull up or even even a mini map would be awesome okay well let's go fight the boss man boss man the fact that like no matter what the distance is it was still showing up on my mini uh on that little compass up top I think kind of is telling you that it's a little bugged or something I don't know because like right now I just now can see the boss over here so so we know we have to fight the medbot if I can go one turn and kill off one of the other wave, or one of the other guys and one of the other waves, I'm gonna feel pretty confident. The med bot, remember, isn't really scary. It's just he reses the dead. And do we have, actually now let's say that, Molotov smoke grenade. We have a lot of grenades now. Nice. Oh, uh, you actually don't have any grenades. Do that and do a grenade. And then do a grenade. We don't have an EMP. That's all I was hoping for. We don't have an EMP. Yeah, I wanted an EMP, but that's that'll we'll live. We'll live. I kind of also would like to get the height advantage here, specifically from her. Because there was this nice little thing right here, which is going to get a nice little shot up top on people. The question is, and I don't know this for a fact, are we going to be able to shoot at anyone other than the medbot? I know we can definitely take the medbot from up here. Is that worth it? Probably not. Yeah, I'm going to say no. Can we jump off over here? Because this would just save me a little bit of time. Ah! No one's taking damage, right? <laughs> you can't hear us yelling and screaming. So I would like to kill the sect hunter. And then we got brother Skog and there's two other guys. If I could kill the sect hunter without other people realizing it, that might be very helpful. Oh, there's another butcher over there. Okay, well, let's go kill this butcher first. Oh my gosh, so many guys to kill. This guy should be moving around. I would be really shocked if this guy wasn't. Come on, duck. Come on, duck boy. Let's go. He actually maybe isn't. Yeah, he maybe isn't. What happens if we kill him right now? Does that engage everyone? Once again, no clue. No clue. Kind of sitting here just hoping that he's going to move out, but it doesn't look like that's going to happen. So, then in that case, we should wait for this guy that's moving right there to go in a different direction. I don't know. Maybe we just go. Maybe we just go. I actually hit the wrong button. Did not mean to shoot that time. Did not mean to shoot. At all. Whoopsie. Yeah, that's a problem. Uh, can we kill you with a shot? Hmm, potentially. Hmm, 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 hmm. This is awkward, man. We're gonna have to get a bunch of 75 percenters to hit. Hmm. The problem is I don't want to move out of cover. Oh. Nice headshot. Bye. Call me. Sweet. You wasted him. That doesn't put us in combat with everyone. Nice. Okay. Okay, that actually answers a lot of questions for us. Uh that really does. So let's get everyone out. You turn your flashlight off. And so then we're going to want to kill this other guy right here when boss man is turned around. I don't know if they're next to each other, if that triggers. I don't exactly know how that works. Hey, guys, regroup. Let's get you, like... I'm going to save really fast because I don't know. Honestly, a lot of this is just trying to figure things out. Can you hit from where you're at? No, but it looked like she moved within range. So what happens when boss guy walks over there and immediately sees a dead body? No idea. No idea. Oh. 
No idea. So we just need 100% on you. That's a 75%. I don't want a running gun. We're, we're gonna... I don't know if this is smart or not. He's dead. Okay, nice, 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 nice. Hey, regroup, guys. I think we... Okay, what happens when you see the dead body? Absolutely nothing. Okay, so he doesn't even care that we kill the dead body. So then, last but not least, we should just go blow up this uh, pyro. Yeah, I suppose that's literally all we need to do then. Is there any way to get in here? We can actually go into this little corner right here and probably be in a good spot. And then all we have to do is take on brother and a little robot and we're good. Okay, and I'm just going to put you here. I would rather you not have knocked him back, just to be honest. That kind of sucks, probably, a little bit. Yeah. Yeah, because now my accuracy is really bad. Hi. Okay. I think we take the 50-50 and we hope. Oh, okay. Woo. Oh, you were grog. That was amazing. All right, they know we're alive now. That's fine. So we killed off everyone but Brother Scrog. I think this is fine. I think this is fine. The getting completely flanked is less fine. We would like to kill. Okay, we gotta kill Robit. We gotta kill Robit, buddy. Hog Rush does what? Knocking him back, incapacitating them for one turn. Can we actually do this? Yes. I don't really want to run into the fire. That seems like a bad idea. Uh, what? Donut. Okay. That works. So, then what we need... What did the wings do? Fly to a selected range. Oh, so you could, like, fly up high, I guess. <coughs> Excuse me. How long are we at? 22 minutes. <coughs> well, here's the other thing. We should use our better weapon at this point. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, I actually don't want to use your moth wings. I don't know what's going on with that. Tree hugger does what? I forgot. <coughs> Pins down nearby enemies. I don't know if that stops. Man, dude, my my voice. I'm apologizing for this right now. Uh, we can do quite a bit of damage this way. It doesn't look like it's stopping his med pack. No. No. And then all we have is a smoke grenade. If I smoke grenade him, will he be able to see the enemy? It's a very good question. I suppose, whatever, let's try it. My hope is he can no longer see the enemy. And so because of that, he's gonna run out. No, he leveled him. Or he picked him up. That's unfortunate. Well, that sucks. Meh. So you need to reload. And then you should be able to see the pyro. Decent damage, decent damage, decent damage. I'm a little concerned with brother dude because he's now going to be standing up and potentially flanking me. So... Uh, brother dude also completely disappeared from the map, which is a whole nother issue. But I, I this is not a smart idea to like be spreading out damage like this. But I think we got to. And I still believe Ducks needs to run up here. I just don't quite get how the wings work, man. 
Invalid target out of reach. Fly to the selected location. I have no idea, guys. I have no idea. I would love to fly, but it doesn't really seem possible. So, you are blocked by smoke. Alright, well, we gotta move you around a little bit. Uh, how do we rotate? It's Q, okay. So, I think I'm gonna put you over here. And then, what is this percentage here? 75%. And the hope is we kill the pyro. And then, we have Brother Slog on our backside. Okay, that works. So, Robot might come up and punch us. But I think I'm fine with that. Oh, he's gonna go pick up the guy again. I'm actually okay with that. What? Where, is brother dude just like dead down here? I'm not quite sure what's going on with this. Alright, well, that's fine. We bugged out the guy. It kind of feels like we did. Not gonna lie, it kind of feels like we did. Blocked by smoke. How is he blocked by smoke? I'm a little mad by this. Yeah, a little mad by this. I don't really want a Molotov. No ammo and equipped weapon. <sighs> I guess we're just gonna do this. Just to do as much damage as possible. And then... Dude here literally can't do anything right now. Because everything's blocked by smoke. So instead we could take a shot over there. Man, both of these suck. What if we move? Once again, wings would be great. Wings would be wonderful right about now. Med kit, I'm not super concerned with. I am a little concerned with uh, dude throwing stuff at me from behind. You know what we could do? We could move here and overwatch. Actually, that's, I think, our best option. Since we can't hit him, we'll just overwatch. overwatch. And then he picks up one of these guys, and then hopefully we can kill the pyro right away. Okay, he's alive again. And he's flanking me. In heavy cover. Absorbed. Nice. Somehow we didn't get a single shot on that. That's a little unfortunate. Uh, I think I'm okay going for medbot. Because I'm cool with him just throwing flames at me. I will live with that all day long. You need ammo. You are also being potentially flanked. I think we just gotta go kill Medbot. She might take some flame damage. I think it's worth it. I actually don't even know if this is cover, but I gotta kill that Medbot. Nice. Nice. So the question is... Mr. Boomstick Man. Can I do a flank? Can I, like, run and gun up here somewhere and put you into a flanking spot? It's only a 50% crit chance? Really? Or a 50% hit chance? It seems a little messy. Yeah, I'm not sure how I... I don't think I agree with that. Hmm... So then, what if we run and gun? Can we run and gun and then reload? I actually don't know if that works. I think we just go here. He shouldn't be able to shoot me. And it kind of just gives us a little bit of space. He might be able to come around. That's fine. Pyro needs a turn to reload. I actually did not know that was a thing. 
You're still getting absorbed, right? I'm pretty sure. Yeah, I'm pretty sure you just absorb, so I'm not really worried about that. That's 75%. How's that only 75%, man? I guess height advantage? It's the only thing I can think of. That actually also puts you within range of the other guy. I think we just go for the 75. And we put ourselves in cover, just to be safe. This actually won't kill. Wow, it's getting fun. Uh, okay, and then I need to put you in a spot where we can get the kill. What does that look like? No ammo and equipped weapon. Yeah, she has no ammo on either of her weapons. Frick. Alright, well let's just reload this one. And hopefully we can get the kill here. 75%. Alright, that works. We might get flanked here, but this will be fine. This will be fine. So, all we have left is Brother Bobby. Uh, How would we like to do that? I would like to kill you and be in full cover. That's 100%. We have one shotgun shell left. We can actually hog rush you again. Uh -huh. Okay, okay, okay. So, I don't think this works. I think we have to move up. This might be a bad idea, but I think... I don't think Hog Rush was too AP, right? If it is, I completely screwed this up. Now we're good. And so now we knocked him down. And now it's our turn. And we are just going to unload. But let's reload first. And then we're going to just shotgun you in the face, buddy. <laughs> nice. Nice. Okay. All right. And then fly. I, did we play this perfectly? I am pretty sure we just played this perfectly, guys. Heck yeah, dude. I, I still don't get why fly doesn't work. Yeah, I, I don't quite get why fly doesn't work. You don't have any ammo. So we're just going to walk you up here. And reload. And can you shoot where you're at? I think it's the same thing. I think we got to walk you up here and then reload. She can actually get all the way up here, which would get rid of some of that height advantage. Got to figure out how this uh, freaking flight crap works, man. All right, well, let's just put you in cover for now and reload. Hopefully the guy uh, is still dead. Okay, good, good, good. Only 50% chance here. But I think you can just kill him off. Goodbye, brother Skog. Nice. That was brutal, dude. That was brutal. Also, that was perfect, man. That was beautiful on so many different levels. Wow. I, like, I legitly am shocked at how well that went. That, I am, I'm shocked. I did not expect that to go that well. Okay, good, 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 good. L green eye, 30% added weapon range. Uh, we might want that on the sniper rifle. Give it all the range, man. Uh, scrap. Was there a weapon over here? I don't think there was. I think we grabbed the only one. Molotov, scrap. Uh, I think we're good to just to go. Who was the first guy we killed? Where did we get uh, hit into combat? I think it was this guy that was right there. So I think we're good to actually just do uh the freeman, the freeman, the freeing. The smell of gunpowder fades. We're safe for now. We free the prisoner. He's a stalker named Magnus, part of Hammond's team, Selma's partner. Hey, you want to join us? Magnus is a mutant too. Not on the outside, but on the inside. He's got powers, Ooh. mind powers, but he's not insane like the Nova sect. He's yo. I want you calm, to join me, man. Real calm, tune into some frequency only he can hear. Magnus tells his tale. Him and Hammond were ambushed by the Novasect. Novasect heard about Hammond. Heard he could talk to machines. Get machines going. So they left Magnus here to die. And took Hammond south to their hangout. They call it the Spear of Heaven. Novasect would make Hammond interpret the gifts of the ancients and open the gates to Eden. Whatever that means. Okay. 
Magnus thinks they're gonna blow up the zone and take the Ark with them. I suggest we rescue Hamel before something goes boom. Selmer and Magnus agree. Even ducks. Sweet! Sweet! We got another guy! Heck yeah, dude! Heck yeah! Uh, do we? Magnus is now available for selection. How, 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 can you only have three in your squad? Oh, you can only have three in your squad? Oh no! Ah, that sucks. That sucks. Uh, okay, let's see. You got four points available, so we can increase your HP by one. I don't think I really care about that. Uh, you got five points available. Draw attention. I don't think we cared about. Uh, jump to any location within range or running gun. Hmm. I think we're gonna run and gun. Yeah, let's run and gun, and then let's go ahead and swap out. And Magnus, dude, he looks like, uh, uh, um, uh, not Deadeye. Uh, the dude from Deadpool. Okay, so you got Rambino. Seven damage. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Uh, okay. And then, let's see. He has six HP, 12 movement, zero armor, and then 10 throw. Uh, he has 18 points available. Immune to Overwatch attack while sprinting. 25% of showing bullets out of the air. So basically, if someone shoots, you basically have a chance to just stop it. Sneak between covers. That's nice. You can basically just sneak up to people. Electrical attack that jumps between group enemies. So there's a chance maybe that it stuns them I'm, or control an organic enemy. That seems awesome. Enables an action after sprinting. Critical skull splitter and then silent assassin. Uh, I kind of like the shield. I like the sprint between covers. I like that. And then I think I will go immune to overwatch while sprinting. Yeah, but that's only while sprinting, though. Nah, I think I'll do chain lightning. Chain lightning! So the question is, do we want to use him or someone else? Health booster probably would also be worth it here. I assume they gain HP even if we're not using them. Yeah, so if we went back to squad now, what's the difference? She has 4 HP, but that's probably from her armor, right? Probably from her armor. Uh, it's only adding three, so she just has plus one. And then she has some really good weapons. Huh. I kind of do like her, though. The vines. What else did she have? She has running gun. Low cover works the same as high cover. Reach high places by sprinting or moving in combat. Area effect disables enemy movement for one turn. I think depending on the uh, team, she might be okay. But I think for now, I think I'd probably run with uh, the other guy. Yeah, I think so. Disable mechanical enemy for two turns. Extra 25% weapon range. Oh my gosh. Yeah, that's amazing. All right. Well, let's head back to Ark. Um, I am going to go ahead and swap her out. Yeah, let's just swap her out for now. So, hi. Uh, I don't want any weapon. Can I just, like, remove? Uh, remove. 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 Okay, and then let's go squad swap you over. Thank you. And then inventory Rambino is probably honestly better than the state switcher It has less range 20 15% crit chance one additional crit damage chance to burn enemies more crit damage by a lot. More damage, a lot better crit chance, more ammo, less range. Yeah, way, way, way better. Uh, but we'll take the silent weapon. And actually, hold up. Let's do this. None. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. And I want to put the pistol here. And then we'll do Rambino there. Okay. And then outfit. Let's do hidden. And let's do the better armor. Okay. I think that'll work for now. Uh, I'm going to swap them back, and we might as well go ahead and just put, like, the better, like, the weapons on her, just in case. Like, the only thing is, maybe, I don't know this for a fact, but maybe at some point, uh, all four members get pulled out. I don't know. I don't know. So let's just have her uh, looted, just in case, if it's, like, XCOM. Okay, well, we're going to wrap this episode up here. Hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, drop a like, comment, and let me know what you think. As always, hit the subscribe button, join the game, comment, and share your support. Um, what is this? There are many facilities. What used to be... Okay. Well, it doesn't say like it's a uh, super high level. Uh, I think we probably want to go back to the high road and clear that out, though. And I'm assuming we're going down... Oh, no. We got to go all the way over there. Okay. But uh, we'll go back to Ark, and I'll see you guys next episode. Bye, everybody!